Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have tons of cleaning motivation for you guys. I am cleaning all over the house today. I'm tackling some areas that have been neglected for quite some time. And I'm also giving you guys a little bit of laundry motivation. So if you are in need of lots of cleaning motivation to tackle the real life messes in your home, please keep watching. I would love if you gave this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. And if you're not subscribed, please do. I would love for you to join my channel and introduce yourself down below in the comments because I love to get to know everyone. And as you can see, we have lots to do, so let's get right into it. We are getting started in my son Wyatt's room. His room is always a complete disaster whenever I find it's time to do my weekly cleaning in here. So like the dusting and vacuuming. So there's always a million little toys to pick up. So that's what I'm doing first. I'm getting everything off the floor, putting things back where they belong. I definitely need to do a declutter and organization of his toys in here but also in the entire house so I definitely have that on my list but for now they're just gonna go where they've been going and then I'm gonna get to cleaning a little bit deeper in here so we're gonna do some dusting and some vacuuming I love putting the kids books in the rainbow colored order and I got this from the home edit if you watch their Netflix series or follow them on Instagram or anything but this is kind of their thing that they do to organize and at first I was kind of like I don't think that that would be really great for kids but it actually works perfect in my son's room not so much my daughter's room she's a little too young but he keeps, he keeps it pretty nice in here, and he knows, like, if I tell him, oh, that's a yellow book, he can find the book he's looking for a little bit easier, and it works out great for us. So I would definitely um, recommend you trying that for your toddler's room. We are loving it. Nothing. 
today I had a little bit of laundry to put away for him so I am just folding them now and putting them in the dresser and hanging them up in the closet. As always, there's a million socks that their match is missing. So I have on the left the socks that don't have a match, and then on the right are all the socks that are good to pick from. And that just kind of helps because when I do find a random sock somewhere, I can hopefully find its match there in the drawer. And also, when my son picks out his own clothes, he can find an actual full pair of socks for him to wear for that day. So I just cleaned the window and now I'm going through and dusting all of the furniture in the room and then I'm going to get to vacuuming and kind of catching a little bit of cobwebs that were in some corners that happened that I happened to see and just getting it super nice and clean in here. Now we are down in my daughter Elena's room. Her room isn't quite as a disaster as Wyatt's room just because we don't play in here as often as we do upstairs. But this room is on the main floor so sometimes, you know, the little tornadoes, aka my kids, kind of whip their way into this room and tear out all the books and throw things everywhere. Um, from time and time again throughout the day. So it does get a little bit messy. So I'm going to do a little bit of tidying up in here. Um, put a little bit of laundry away. As you can see, there's a pile on the floor that needs to get put in the washer. And then we're going to do the same old dusting and vacuuming in here as well. I know you 
This changing table my brother-in-law made. We absolutely love it. It works super great. We used it for Wyatt. Now we're using it for Elena. I usually clean it every few months or so. I haven't cleaned it in a while. There's all this dog hair that has somehow made its way up here as well as whatever else yuckiness got in here. So I'm going to take the vacuum to it and then I'm going to give it a good wipe down and just clean it up a bit. I used to clean this a lot more when my son was a baby, probably because, you know, when you're changing their diapers and boys like to pee everywhere, so I always had to clean this, but not so much with my daughter because we never really had those accidents. So I am tending to it now so that I don't have to think about it anymore. Take my life for granted Say a bunch of stuff you never mean, yeah Say a bunch of stuff you never mean, yeah So in my last video I asked you guys if you liked the shorter cleaning videos or the longer ones and a lot of you said that you really enjoy the longer cleaning videos, you like to clean along with me during those so today's a long one for you guys so I hope you're cleaning along with me and if you are tell me what you're working on down in the comments below. We keep on talking from body to body. So now we are in my living room and this room just kind of needed a quick tidy up, um, just a light cleaning. There is, you know, the usual things lying around that I wanted to put back to where they belong. And then the other thing on my list was to vacuum the couch and to clean the floors because they were so bad as you will see a little bit later on in a few clips. But I knew I needed to get down to that today, so first I'm gonna tidy up so then I can get to those things. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action, what we can be. Life with no distractions. Oh. 
So we're just giving the couch a quick vacuum. I have two big dogs and they shed like crazy. And then on top of that, I have also have two toddlers and we don't have any rules about eating on the couch or anything like that. Maybe we should, but they get pretty bad. So I wanted to quick run the vacuum over to get all of the crumbs, the hair, all of it. So we are on to the floors. They are nasty guys. As you can see, I tried my best to pick up all of its nastiness, but this particular spot gets really bad because this is where the kids' table sits when they eat their breakfast and they're never clean, so there's always stuff on the floor and just regular day-to-day -day life happens here. and. It got so bad. I haven't steamed it in longer than I should have, so I'm gonna first vacuum and then it'll happen it'll have to happen later, but I will get to steaming it as well. And yes, there is totally toys underneath my TV stand and no, I did not pick them up. I usually wait till there's a good amount under there and then I will grab them all out at once. If I was picking out toys out of there every single day, I would, you know, go insane. It's just not real life. So those toys are going to stay in there a few days longer and I'll get to them next time. Small, watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend my coin for sure. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. It is much later in the day, as you can see. The kiddos were over at grandma and grandpa's house for the day which is why I got so much cleaning done before but now they are in bed so I'm gonna finish up my cleaning and I'm in the dining room now I wanted to clean the windows real quick and then do a little dusting of part of the furniture in here before I got to the floors Drive a faster car, lay my troubles to rest, blow the smoke through my cigarette. City lights looking fine, and I know this is my time now. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. This is an area that sometimes gets neglected a lot too, under under our table, our dining room table. Um, 
I just don't vacuum under here every time I vacuum and I know it gets bad but it's easy for me to you know kind of put it off because I'm not stepping on it or anything but I definitely wanted to get to it today. a faster car i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna skip my breaks i'm gonna make mistakes i'm gonna skip my breaks i'm gonna make mistakes i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna skip my breaks i'm gonna make mistakes i'm gonna skip so now that we are done vacuuming, I'm going to get to steaming all of the areas that I just vacuumed. I love my steamer, however, I don't know if it's still in stock. I always try to look for it, um, but I do usually add a similar version from Amazon down in my description, description box below if you want to check that one out. I love using the steamer. I think it makes the floors feel cleaner than anything else I've ever tried before. And I really love to put an essential, a few drops of an essential oil on the bottom pad just to kind of give it some type of smell because the thing with steaming is it doesn't have that clean smell like you do when you're mopping. So I love using essential oils for that purpose. I still care about us How do you move on when everything goes wrong? I'm trying to find a way to get you out of my head Don't know how to cope with being so broken Girl, I can't forget about what we said I just want to love you a little bit more Don't just walk away from me and close the door And now that the cleaning is all taken care of, I had a ton of laundry that I needed to fold and put away tonight. <laughs> this, these clothes have been sitting in these baskets for several, several days. I don't know how many days, but a while. We seriously stink at, you know, folding our clothes and putting it away. It's not our strong suit here in the Grimes household, we'll admit it, but my husband, he's taking care of um, a basket in the bedroom and I'm sitting in the living room watching Netflix and taking care of my baskets. Um, I'm watching right now Friends from College. I know it's been on Netflix for a little while now, but I just watched it and I actually just finished it. I loved it. So if you've seen that, let me know down below what you think of that show. If you're watching something else, let me know down below as well because I need a new show to watch now that I finished that one. Alone. In a second I'll be right there 
Turn around, let it rain Turn around and let it rain on me Don't you be afraid Just for me You don't need no space Just follow me Like a mirror you reflect me Like a Friday night on the weekend I feel blessed and free I just don't want this moment to end But now you say you gotta go Baby, why you gotta go? And that is about it for today's video. Thanks, you guys, so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. And like I said, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. And drop your name down below so I can say hi. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.